Hello and welcome to another video on how to use the Speechbox app. My name is Henry and today I'm going to show you how to add students or patients to Speechbox so you can take advantage of the data collection feature. So uh, first thing to do is open up Speechbox on your Mac desktop on iPad or iPhone and you're gonna uh, make sure that you have data collection enabled. You can do that one of two ways. Just tap on the gear icon in either an open box or the main interface here and make sure that you flip this switch here that says data collection. And once that's there, uh, pick any box that you wanna open up and you will see that in the upper right hand corner here, you're gonna have this little like chart bar graph looking icon there. When you tap on that, that brings up the data collection menu there. So again, I'll show you what it looks like when you flip it off, you can see that button disappears. And when you flip it back on, it appears. So tap on that button there. You can see I have two patients or students already in the list here, um, but I'm going to add a new one. And the way that you add another one is you tap on the button at the bottom here that says add new client. And you simply just put that in there. And I'm gonna put, um, uh, um, I'll put Henry in here and What's really great is that you can um, you know, make this as public or private as you want. So if you want to have just the last initial, that's totally fine. If you want to put um, you know, the uh, uh, student's full name in there, you're more than welcome to. Um, you, you just do need to have something in there. And then uh, put the date of birth for the student just so you can uh, track it. So we'll just go and put in random date in here. Uh, and then you also have the option to add a photo or it'll just create a little initial icon here for you. So save that student in there. And now when you go back, you'll see that you've got the uh, um, Henry patient there and it has the edit and reports. And the way that you get to that menu is by simply tapping on the student there. And you have, and if you tap on edit, that's gonna bring up the edit um, uh, a client menu here. And if, and if you tap on the reports button, it's gonna bring up the different session reports that you can export. And I'll show you how to do that in just a, a moment. That's it. So thank you very much for watching the video on how to add a patient or a student to Speechbox.